Hello everyone, this is the first video of day 15, 365 days aptitude challenge. And today we are going to continue uh, the topic averages. In the previous session, we have seen some of the questions and we have also seen some of the tricks by which you can solve these questions easily. All right, so today we'll see some more questions. So yesterday I have, uh, uh, what do you say, given this as a homework for you. So I hope you got the answer. So let's see. So average score of 23 students is 32. If students with 54 score leaves the group, then the average of the remaining is. So normally if I have to do this question, what I would do is uh, average score of 23 students is 32. So the sum should be 23 into 32, right? Okay. So I would get some value. I would definitely get some value. Now, out of this sum, okay, a student with 54 years leaves the group. So out of this sum, leaves the group, then what will be the average? So now earlier there were how many students? 23 students. Now it will be 22 students, right? So this whole sum minus 54 divided by 22, whatever answer is there, I would get the answer. Now here, only problem is one, I have to do this complicated multiplication and then Take this value, subtract it, and then divide it by 22. Okay, so pro process looks little hectic because of the calculation. Now, what I would do is, I would say, instead of doing this, now the average score of 23 students, if it is 32. Okay, if a student with 54 score leaves the group, now if the student with 32 leaves the group, okay, if the student with the score 32 leaves the group, there is no difference in the average. Why? Because the average is also 32 and the student with the age 32 is leaving the group. So there is no difference in the average. But instead of 32, if 54 is leaving the group, that means this guy is not only taking the average which is 32, apart from the average, he is taking 54 more with him. That means he is taking 22 extra. Okay, he is taking 22 extra. Now, what if he is taking 22 extra? This 22 extra, which he is not supposed to take because his average, if on an average, if it is 32, if he is leaving, he should also take 32. But if he is taking 22 extra, this 22 extra load will fall on the remaining students who are in the group. So, out of 23, if one student is going out, that means 22 students are there. So, this 22 score which he is taking will fall on the other 22 students. So if 22 load falls on the other two students, there will be a load of 1 on each of the students. So the average will be affected by 1 for each student. So instead of 32, now the average will become 31. Why it is reducing? Because he is taking 22 extra and that 22 extra load will fall on the remaining 22 students. So the average will be affected by, by 1 and now the average becomes 31. I hope you guys understood it and if you have not understood it, okay, please re-watch the video once again. Okay, because these are important concepts, right? So if I have to get this answer, I can get the answer within 10 seconds, right? Or else I would take one and a half minute also, right? So we have to take one and a half minute. We have to complete this particular kind of questions in 10 to 15 seconds only. So that is the main agenda behind this one. All right, so next question. Next one, let's see. Now the average age of a group is 28.5, okay? So average, uh, group ka average is 28.5. If a man with 53 years exit the group, Okay, so if the average is 28 and man with 53 is exiting the group, that means he is taking extra, right? Okay, as of now, that is what we have understood. And 73 years enter the group. Now, 53 is exiting, but 73 is entering. That means, uh, now one person is going, one person is coming back. And 53 is going, 73 is coming back. That means here I don't need to think about this average. 53 is going, 73 is coming. That means there is a profit of 20. There is a profit of 20. Now what will happen with this profit? Because of this profit, the average of every person will increase because the other person who is entering in, okay, is entering with some 
extra what you say years right so that extra years with which he is entering that will be distributed among others correct okay so if that is distributed among others this 20 extra will is di distributed among others what happened so 73 years enter the group the average became 29 so initially the average is 28.5 now the average became 29 that means for everybody okay for the whole group the average is increased by 0 0.5 how it is increased by 0 0.5 0.5 it is increased by 0 0.5 because 53 exited but 73 entered okay this 73 entered with extra 20 and this was distributed among the group and for each person 0 0.5 is increased question is how many people are there in the group how many are there just divided by 0 0.5 for each person if 0 0.5 was distributed because from 28.5 the average became 29 for each person if 0 0.5 was distributed so 20 can be distributed among 40 people 20 divided by 0 0.5 40 people to 40 people it would be distributed okay i hope everybody of you got this one if you have not understood it please re-watch the video okay and understand it don't keep any doubts because these are very important things okay you're not supposed to keep any doubt here I hope everybody of you got this. Next one. Let's see this question. Now, Paul scored 327, 312, 279 in math, 3 mathematics test out of 350 each. What is the score? What score must he obtain in the next uh, test to have an average of exactly 83 percentage for the fourth test? okay so this is the score he scored in the first second and third test they are asking what score he must obtain in the next test so next test mein kitna aana chahiye out of 350 so each test is out of 350 to have an average of exactly 83 percent for the four test for all the four test he must have an average of 83 percentage okay so in a quite a few ways i can solve this questions uh, let's see in what way we can solve so for each test if it is out of 350 so I can say for four test it will be 1400 correct so out of 1400 I have to maintain what percentage 83 percent I need to maintain 83 percentage of 1400 so how many marks in total I need to get 83 into 14 okay when you are calculating try to be quick right 83 into 10 830 83 into 4 will be equal to uh, 332 overall it will be 1162 so this should be the total score this must be the total score correct okay out of which already he got three scores so when you are calculating don't write it again like this okay 327 312 279 Okay, yes, I will add karke, ne, mat karo. Instead, 300, 300, 200, 800, right? 800 plus 20, 800 plus 30, 800 and 30 plus 70, 900. 907, 909, and 918. So, out of this, just subtract 918. You will get it as 200 and 44 and that should be the answer okay up answer on a chair 244 did you all get this one so this is the normal uh, way of solving it okay uh, method I will tell you another method of uh, solving this one see I will use the concept of unit digit okay so out of the what you say uh, total 1400 out of total 1400 i must maintain 83 percent okay 83 percent i need to maintain okay so 4 into this this is a unit digit concept okay 4 into this that means i must get an answer with a unit digit of 2 okay so my total should be with the unit digit 2 all right out of which out of which 7 is the unit digit here okay 2 is the unit digit here and 9 is the unit digit here 7 plus 2 9 9 plus 9 8 so out of 2 if 8 is subtracted 
okay out of 2 if 8 is subtracted what will be the unit digit here so 12 minus 8 will be equal to 4 so my answer should end with 4 okay that is how i can solve this question that is another way of uh, solving this question okay agar aapko ye doubt aa raha hai to aur ek baar dekho see 1400 of 83 okay i am saying i can do this and say that i should totally get 162 correct okay out of which if i add it normally 918 marks chahiye. okay so i will get 244 now this step i am doing it directly what i am doing i am doing it as 83 percentage of 1400 non-zero unit digit into non-zero unit digit here it should be 2 okay 4 2 is a 12 right 4 3 is a 12 so here it should be 2 now 7 plus 2 9 9 plus 9 18 here the unit digit should be 18 when i subtract it okay the unit digit should be 4 my answer should be with 4 did you all get this one okay that is one way of uh, solving this uh, particular question okay so most of the questions hum log bahut jaldi kar sakte hai but we never think of it we always think if we get the answer it is enough okay it is not like that kabhi kabhi answer aana hi nahi bahut jaldi answer aana bhi bahut important hai okay so i hope you will follow this techniques i we will do some more questions uh, in the next session thank you guys